Oh, wow. Holy cow, check this out. How would you guys feel about having an AI dentist? All right, genuine, genuine curiosity. For those of you guys who are in chat right now, would you guys trust, and maybe not right now, but think in the future. Try to think forward in the future. Some of you may just genuinely disagree with me. You can probably already guess where my opinion lies. Right now, I agree with you. I'd say no. But think in the future. Do you think it may be, let's just, I mean, it, it's hard to give time periods and then have an honest opinion. But let's say, let's, let's be super generous 50 years from now. Do you think you'd feel more confident with a human dentist or an artificial intelligent robot dentist 50 years from now? Well, from how advanced it is now, maybe it will be better than humans in the future. That's kind of my thought process. I think there's a really strong possibility that in the future, these AI robots will be able to execute surgeries and medical procedures with a level of accuracy that humans could only dream of. And it will kind of be a shift in culture where like you'll almost want a robot to do it because like a human could have shaky hands, they could forget something, they could not be, con you know, especially in a surgery, they could not be considering um, something that could help you in the moment. They may not be able to work fast enough, they may not. <laughs> I think at the, I think at the rate that AI is going, as long as it can, it, it, once it gets really, really good, I think it only makes sense that AI will be per, uh, performing most of the surgeries. I don't even think humans will be doing it. Nah, bro, they would strap you down and take your teeth. True. Yeah, the AI would pull your teeth out and put your teeth in itself and it would try to impersonate you. That's true. Let's see what the comments say on this tweet, actually. I, for one, welcome our AI overlords. And if they read this, hopefully they'll spare me. <laughs> If it has 100% success rate like future surgeons, I'm all up for it. Had an orbital surgery done incorrectly and now I get double vision when I look directly upwards, up left or right with that eye. That's what I'm saying, man. There's little mistakes even with experienced people. And I'm not saying that AIs would be necessarily 100%, but I think anybody would agree that robots will get to a point where they will have a much higher success rate on average than humans. It only makes sense. They'll work meticulously. They'll be able to do the exact same procedure every, they'll be able to like fully scan your skull and figure out precisely where everything is and have like, dude, it, it, it's kind of like asking, do you think a finely tuned robot could beat you at operation? If you played operation for like a thousand hours, who do you think would win over that thousand hours, right? And who do you think would be the, the, the first person to like accidentally touch the side of something when, you know, picking up a little whatever, right? I think, yeah, I think it could be a super net positive too, in the sense that maybe it brings me overall medical costs down a ton. It could also make medical procedures more widely available once the once the robotics get past the point of being, um, you know, once they get really good, but they're still new, they'll be really expensive. But then once they sort of get normalized and they're everywhere, you'll be able to go in. Like if you if you get a surgery, if you need a surgery at like 2.30 in the morning, you can do that and not have to worry about like the doctor who's doing it being fatigued or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm wildly off, but I like to think that we're headed in a positive direction, at least for medical AI stuff. I think we're headed in a very positive direction. But again, just to reiterate right now, absolutely not. But have you guys heard those cool stories about like AI detecting early stages of cancer in people, being able to detect early stages of cancer that humans wouldn't be able to see as a way to uh, allow treatment to start earlier than it otherwise would have. And it's like saving lives. It's a real thing. And that's been happening realistically for a little while. Like that's not a super new thing, but still fun to think about.